today I have a special guest coming to see my apartment for the very first time. Hi. What's up, girl? Oh my gosh, it's so <laughs> weird seeing the couch in a different place. Hi. Hi, Hi baby girl. I'm um, just really open. Mommy. Yeah, thank you. Mommy. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is a huge bathroom. I know, right? For an apartment? That's what everyone says when they come in here. I love it. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, this is cute. Oh my god. Yeah, this is the master bedroom. Um, this is actually going to be the girls' room. Oh and then this gosh. is going to be their bathroom. They're, this is like a girl's dream. Like, I imagine know, Imagine huh? being six years old <laughs> and having like all of this in the closet. I know, they're going to love it. Wow, it, it's actually a really good size. Yeah, thank you. It's so weird seeing the court that was there. Like, yeah, I know, here. Okay, I've seen this comment a few times and I thought I'd take the time to address it. It goes something along the lines of, I would have needed all new furniture and decor to completely restart, and I totally understand where they're coming from. You see, I too did think, is this a little weird to keep considering all the history behind it? But the truth is, this furniture has always felt like it was mine because for the majority of the time that we owned it, Kira really never liked it. That's what I never liked. I liked it when we first had it. Yeah. But then I feel like because it's such a certain style, very quickly became old. So for me, adding it to my new place kind of just solidified the fact that it was mine the entire time. But I totally understand why some people would feel like this would hold them in some part of the past. That's how it was. I, I had to get rid of everything. Really? Yeah. No, no. I, but I think girls are a little bit more like emotionally attached. To oh, things. maybe. Yeah, that could be it. So after realizing that this furniture is mine, it's been mine for a while, it's me, it's my style, I feel like in almost a poetic fashion, this symbolizes me in its new environment. And not to say that I didn't love this furniture in the old house, but I feel like it just looks a little better here. Oh my god, that's like the worst thing. I want to throw that away so damn long ago. See, and the fact that you don't like it though, I think it makes me feel like, oh yeah, see, this is my stuff anyways. Well, it looks good in here. I'm not like yeah. bashing how it looks. Just I remember when we had that for like a year, I was like, Oscar, we've got to find a new piece. Oh my god. <laughs> what was showing here, the puppy? Hey, so what do you think? I think it's stunning. I'm surprised you have decor on the wall. I'm not going to lie to you. I know. But I think you... it looks good. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. And it fits really well in this house, actually. Usually decor like this, you can't move to another house. It doesn't exactly. Really fit. I think it's because the great kitchen, or the great kitchen, which I was afraid wasn't going to look good. So yeah, I'm happy with that. Well, peace out, girl. Thanks for coming over. Feel free to come over anytime. Oh well. <laughs> just maybe not all the time while I don't follow your rules. <laughs> Whatever I want, because you just said. I wanted to say it. How'd you know I was going to say that? <laughs> My family's leaving me now, you guys. Aww. You guys literally just got here. This is the shortest trip you've ever made. Yeah, we just kept it up here. That's too kind, and that makes me feel even sadder that you're leaving. We didn't do anything fun while you were here. And we fun. Yeah, yeah, it was was fun. Okay, that makes me feel better. A little bit. Yeah. Aww. They're gonna quickly say goodbye to the kids, and then off we go then. Damn it! Never come for this short ever again, or, all right? Either you stay for a week, or you don't come at all. Do re mi fa sol si do mi 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 mi. You're a little too happy to be leaving. What did I do wrong? <laughs> Just <kidding. laughs> Thanks again, you guys. Peace out guys, thanks again. Love you guys. Peace out. That was so sweet of them, I can't believe that. Back at the apartments, and hey, at least Liliana's still with me. Thank you for staying. I mean, she's kind of forced to. She doesn't have a way back until, <laughs> what is it, January, February? February, it is January, what am I saying? I have a few questions for you though. I've been making this move all about me and my experience, but you've been living with me for what? June, July, August, September, October, November, December, January. Oh shit, eight months. Dude, she's been in this situation with me for the last eight months, and so, how does it feel for you? Like, how do you like the apartment? I like it more than your house, honestly. Really? Yeah, it's kind of a cozier vibe, huh? It's your vibe, it's more like you. Yeah, I love that. Oh my god, the fact you're saying that, that's exactly what I wanted this place. So thank you. Glad you like it though, cousin. That makes me so happy. And Good choice. <laughs> yeah, thank you. You're waiting for a three bedroom. I know, Two huh? Two bedrooms, 
that, <laughs> that would have been nuts. I'm glad I waited too. I think it's time we hang up this thing. All right, that didn't go as planned. All right, let's try it again. Putting up a TV is exciting, but truthfully, it's nothing special. What I'm really excited about, though, is this piece right here. Look at that. Yo, once I hide this wire, oh my goodness, it's going to look so modern and nice. Mm, mm, I'm loving it. Once again, matches the vibe of the rest of the place. Oh, that's gonna look clean once I get rid of that wire. Cables really are an eyesore, but I'm hoping that the kids don't end up leaning on this thing because if they do, it's not gonna survive that. Look at all this wiggle already. Maybe another bracket might help. Truthfully, even with another bracket, it won't survive the kids jumping on it or pulling on it. Hopefully, they don't do that, but Murphy's Law, anything that can go wrong will go wrong. I expect that to fall sooner or later. So sad, but gotta be mentally prepared. Prepare for the worst, hope for the best. I also hung up the kids' TV. Only problem is, I lost the remote to it, so we can't use it. Gonna have to figure out how to solve that issue. Once again, cable's such a nice or We'll be hiding that in the future as well. I'm loving it though. I'm loving it.